Here with Coach Lenny Jankowski of the Vera Beach Fighting Indians for the 12 hour trip. Pretty nice now as they beat the Oscar Smith Tigers tonight here in Chesapeake, Virginia, 28 21. Coach, you guys got down early with Oscar Smith striking first, but Alan Glanville, what a story he is coming back from the broken neck of Oscar Smith in his face. Three touchdowns and made the really momentum changing play with his pump block and scooping around for a touchdown. Yeah, I mean, he's a, he's a tremendous talent, obviously, and, and uh, you know, this year we've, we've had the, uh, the opportunity to use him on both sides of the ball and we just try to take advantage of that first season. And, uh, He's got a bunch of, you know, he's got a, a lot of football savvy, and, and so he's, you know, he's, he's very hedgy. He's always around the football, and so that combination, you know, with his athleticism, you know, he's, he's a big play guy for us. And obviously tonight, he, he, uh, he had three big, three big ones. You get an established program, a lot of talented players, led by David Reese, the Florida commit, who was really playing well tonight defensively off the edge there. And Keen Dixon, the running back, committed to Syracuse running well in the second half. What was kind of the game plan coming in against this Oscar Smith team, which has a tough defense, an experienced defense? And can score quickly. You know what? I, I, we knew that we were in for defense. You know, with their defense, um, they're, they're so strong up the middle, and, and uh, you know, we we, uh, we were fortunate to get a couple big plays on them because they were they were uh, you know taking over the line of scrimmage, and, and uh, those inside backers are phenomenal. They they got a couple really good D linemen, uh, and, and they don't give you much room in the secondary as well. You know, I just was I was very impressed with their, their program, uh, their coaching staff, and it, it's just a quality place, and a uh, no privilege to be here, and I. I feel fortunate we're going to come out on top. And it sounds like from what the scrimmage showed, just some vanilla stuff, it didn't show you a ton, but it looked like you guys concentrated on taking away the screen game, which they're so known for. Reese did a good job at DM, but also I thought your linebacker, Andre Johnson, made a ton of tackles, and then a sophomore, Manuel Anderson, played well in the back end for you. Yeah, those guys, uh, you know, they're, they're very good athletes, and uh, they play extremely hard. I, I, you know, what more than anything, uh, way past the X's and O's and way past the scheme, I just was, I was pleased with our effort. I mean, it, it wasn't like they were – there was any lack of effort on their side either. So I, I just thought for early in the season, our, our first game, their first game, I thought it was uh, it was a quality football game with two very good football teams and, and a lot of talent on the field. And, and you guys get to win, but both teams I think take progress and there's some good things out of the fact that it was a clean game, not a lot of penalties or a lot of stupid stuff being no seen out there. No doubt. I think, you know, and, and, and that's what you have to stay guarded when you have this much talent on the field at once. Um, you know, you want to keep it clean and you want to you, you want to try to play. And I, I know their coaching staff preaches the same stuff. And it, it was uh, um, it was nice to see that come to fruition. Last two for you, thank you for your time. You have a, a big time receiver in Jacob Bell, but you had a pass by Jacob Bell tonight. And you got a couple of razzle dazzle plays in the tricks tonight. Tell me about those a little bit. Well, you know, we were struggling with the with the uh, you know the stuff that we typically try to do. So I uh, felt like you know we we uh, we struggled with field position early. We had an opportunity. I think we, we had we started that drive around midfield, and so we took a shot. Uh, it, it, Jacob just kind of bought himself some time. We had a receiver out there open, and you know, he made a terrific play. And final one for you, Coach. Uh, coming up here to Virginia, it's a 12-hour trip. What's this do for your program? And what do you look at this Oscar Smith team in terms of the teams you play in Florida? You see a lot of great teams, but what type of test was this for you guys, and how do you look at it going forward? Here? Well, I, I think to start, you know, um, it, it's. Uh, our school, in the history of our school, 90 years of our program, uh, we've never played an out-of-state team, never, never gone out-of-state anyway. And uh, so it was an experience. I, I think that that's the first thing that we take away from it. But, um, but, but you know, we came up here knowing that, that it was a game to be played, and, and uh, we had our hands full with a, with a very talented group. And so um, I just think that, that starting the season off this way, against a team as talented as Oscar Smith, uh, you know, being fortunate to come away with a victory. I think that that, that should provide us some momentum moving forward and, and uh, hopefully hopefully uh, get the thing rolling for us this season. It's still a long season. Absolutely. A great battle. Vera Beach wins at 28-21 over Oscar Smith. Thank you for your time. Okay, thank you. Congratulations. All right, thanks, guys. All right, thanks. thanks.